Hey guys, Britta here, welcome back to the channel. Welcome to a first look at the Supermarket Simulator demo. Now this game um, is due out 21st of February for me, so depending where you are in the world, it'll be the 20th or the 21st I suppose, but set into a new game, um, check it out. I just played a little bit, um, just so I knew that the game was actually working properly. And so I can check it out before you guys, but um, welcome to Supermarket Simulator Demo. You can play the beginning of the full game here. Start by purchasing goods to sell and place them onto the shelves. Don't forget to set prices with a profit to avoid bankruptcy. Okay, cool. All right. First of all, I'm going to move these shelves, I think. Just over to this back corner. And we'll have a look and see what stock we can actually buy. So I believe there's... um. Some unlockable stuff here too, so the starter pack one. So once we purchase this, we can actually put more things in. Starter pack two, starter pack, uh, medium pack one. So there's lots of other stuff we can add to the game. Bills, growth, we can expand um, on our store. We can hire people, obviously in the full version. Same as storage and customization, so that's pretty good. It's going to be a lot in um, the full version, which is exciting. So at the moment, we've only got... Um, Six products, some eggs, some cereal, some sliced bread, some pasta, oil, and flour. So I think I want to go with, um, I think that's, no, that should be fine. We have one of each of those. Let's order that. And furniture, we've got shelf, fridge, fridge, and spotlight as well. But everything gets delivered um, instantly. Uh, yeah, we go. This shelf here. So that's there. Throw that there, so we pick it up with left mouse, press left mouse to open, then press and hold on the shelf to load it onto that shelf, which is really, really cool. Good um, good mechanic, and it makes it nice and easy. You don't have to actually stress about putting things, um, like placing things on top of each other and stuff. I don't think we can add any more to the shelf than that, even though it looks like we probably could. Uh, they're going to be $3. Uh, what's that, 238 That can be $3. And six thirty eight you can be seven dollars. I don't know what the prices good prices are gonna be, but people will come in and complain um if it's too high. So click on the register here to interact once she actually comes over here. Yep, see too expensive. Okay, who cares? I know someone else will buy it, so it's fine. Uh light switch here on and off. I'll leave it off for now, but hopefully we get some more people. Let me um, grab a. Let's go this way. Quick screenshot. Morning, ma'am. Okay, hopefully she'll actually buy something. There you go. Two boxes of cereal. I'd say the kids must be hungry. Okay, so you click on left click on the cereal to take it. Take her cash. Receive $15, total 14 change $1. So give her a dollar, press spacebar to approve. This guy's got some eggs. Holy crap, mate. $97 change. Alright, so we've got to perform 25 checkouts. So now we can pretty much wait and have a look. Is there anything else we can buy? We can probably order some pasta. Let's get some pasta on the go. Uh, if you want both of those, we're going to need probably a hundred bucks. Both of those. Yep, sliced bread's too expensive. Alright, well, your loss. I'm not too concerned about it. I don't think it's that expensive. 238 is a market price. Maybe we should put it at 250. Dollar fifty profit. Two dollars profit. Or well, 55 profit. Yeah, that's probably a bit better, I suppose. Oh, I didn't actually price that. We have to make sure we price it first. 417. Let's go $4.50. I don't I feel like we don't make enough profit on things. It's really, really grindy to get to the next levels. Um four fifty. Two dollars five profit. Three dollars profit. Dollar fifty, dollar fifty, yeah. Feel like we're not making enough money. Loaf of bread, going over some toast. Right. Perfect. Don't have to give him any change at all. So looking at our next things, I said we need um, 
3992 so it gives you like flower uh, flower for craft dung display rack is where it, you can actually place it and the unit price is 499 each so obviously later on we're gonna have to get unlock fridges and stuff to put milk and water and all that sort of stuff in right so cereal a couple of loaves of bread twelve dollars exactly thank you I just feel like we don't make enough money out of these things I don't know, maybe it's just me, but... Morning, sir. Right, we'll just wait for him to... Think what do you want? Some eggs? Some pasta? I'm not sure what you're going to do with that for breakfast. I suppose it is lunchtime. Uh, 50 cents. Done. So if you do happen to give them, like, a dollar, ten dollars, twenty dollars extra, or whatever it is, you can actually right-click it to put the money back. I did try and shortchange somebody and give them less money back, but it didn't actually work. So if I go $10, I'm like, oh no. You can take your money back by right clicking the bills. Yep, so bang, right click it, done. So if you happen to make a mistake and give them too much, then as I said, you can, you can rectify it without actually losing any money. Right, only seven customers so far. It's already one o'clock. Right, some, a couple of eggs, a couple of bread. Gonna get it through the whole bloody week, I think. Thank you. Eleven dollars exactly. No change. Thank you. So fifty-eight dollars. Um, get rid of that. We'll just grab the flour for now. Then we can add the oil after. Ah, uh, flour. Yeah, we can go there. I'll throw that on the ground for a minute. Ah, uh, eight. Can we make it nine dollars? Nine dollars would be good if we can make that. <coughs> pardon me, make that much money out of it. I hope I didn't scare the crap out of you guys, but. It was unexpected. Right, let's go. Come on, mate. Get, get some flour. Go straight for it. That pasta. Unbelievable. He went for it. Nine dollars isn't too much. Fifty cent. Flour. Money. Give you a dollar back. If we give him a dollar in one cent pieces, that'd be pretty funny, wouldn't it? Right, twenty nine, twenty seven. So let's look at the oil next, which is going to be about sixty bucks because I think we pay. Yeah, we paid like a delivery fee, a shipping fee. I think flowers going to be a good earner for us, but it's bloody... Yeah, you'd probably get two racks of flour straight away. So I feel like we're expanding. Um, and then when we, you know, get oil down, then we run out of a, one bit of stock somewhere, and it's bloody painful. You can actually order another box of eggs and not actually put them on the shelf, like throw them on the ground somewhere, which is really good. We don't actually have to put it on the, on the shelf straight away. This guy's come in for the wife, get something for dinner. Uh, maybe not. And we lose a store point every time someone comes in and says it's too expensive, but not that worried. We make it back anyway, so that's fine. On people. Here we go. It's actually quite a nice little neighborhood, although it's. I don't know how cars get in and out. It's a dead end street, but I think the dev will expand that eventually anyway. Right, what's this guy gonna go for? Ah, oh, the flower's too expensive. Let me let me make it a little bit cheaper. Eight dollar fifty. You come back. I just dropped it fifty cent. Not too late. Right, let's uh turn the light on. God it's it's slow today. I've only got eleven eleven total customers so far. Couple of boxes of cereal for the kids tomorrow. Six bucks. Do this, let's pile this up and see if we can give him dollar and one cent pieces. How annoyed would you be? You'd <laughs> be so bloody annoyed. There you go, sir. Yeah, joke's on you. More cereal. One dollar. I won't do the same to you, love. Right, let's get 
that oil ordered. Uh, what are we short on now? We're getting low on um, eggs again. Oh no, we've still got six eggs. It's not too bad. Alright, I think we shut at 8 o'clock as well. 667, let's go. $7. Yeah, we got six, so we're not really low on anything. Although cereal's getting a little bit low, but uh, turn the light switch on. Yeah, we did that. Here we go. Light cast my ten to eight. Bloody annoying. To come for flour, some oil. Nope. Flour, bread, bread. Oh, three loaves of bread. That's how much bloody toast do you want? Right, one dollar. Thank you. Definitely gonna need some bread. Ah, seventeen fifty. Ten, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, fifty, done. It was nine o'clock that we shut. Okay, loaf of bread. Yep, get some more bread in. This guy's a big spender. $23, $17 change, thank you, and it's 9 o'clock, right, so now we can actually throw that on there, so the display is full, but we can, we can just drop that there, that's fine, right, press enter to finish the day, uh, product found expensive 5, um, plus 90 points, we lost 66.51 today, only because we, um, keep, getting new stock all the time obviously so right you receive daily bills starting today make sure to pay the bills using your computer before their due date or they'll be paid automatically anyway so the more electrical devices you have the more expensive the bills okay let's open up uh, we go back to management bills be nothing there to be tomorrow we get our first bill all right we're gonna need some more cereal eggs pasta today but I also want to save up and get this next level which is 125 but we're also going to need um, a a fridge as well for that morning ma'am Jesus luckily we brought extra bread uh, 550 yeah we can grab that throw that bread on there to that box so now we need eggs and uh, eggs, we need pasta, eggs and pasta done, and then I want to order some cereal next, I think somebody walked out without getting anything, right display is full, that's fine, $84, Unbelievable. Excuse me, ma'am. Wrong way. Eggs. Yeah, it's full. I thought we'd be able to stack a little bit more up there, but we can't. I just passed it by itself. 80 cent. Alright, the cereal. So that's what I mean. Like, we're not making um, a great deal per item. Well, we just need more customers, I suppose. To sort of help us make a bit more money quicker. 50, 70, 80, 1, 2, 3. Why oh, such the big bills? Oh, we need 50, 51 dollars to get more cereal. But oh, that can go there. I don't think we've sold any extra eggs yet. Nope. What did you get? Just one loaf of bread in it. Not going to help me. Oh, 50 cent. Really short changed it then. Yeah, we need more flour too. Oh my god. $24 exactly, thank you. Let's order that. Flour next. This is what I mean. It's like we're... Um, we're constantly just replenishing stock and not making any money. Well, we're obviously making money, but... Trying to replenish stock at the same time is so hard. I think maybe the products need to be a little bit cheaper. 
potentially. Like three ninety nine for cereal is bloody expensive. Dollar forty five for eggs probably isn't too bad. Three bottles of oil, some eggs. Jesus, that's a big, big purchase. Look at her guys. She got three oil as well. Ah, uh, ten dollars. Thank you. One dollar. Thank you. Let's throw these eggs up there. Ah, oh, we didn't buy anything else, did we? Ah, uh, no, we've got our flour on the way. We're going to need... We've got to I'll put a pasta down a lower level for some strange reason. Ah, uh, four dollars. I'll grab our flour. We're going to need some more oil. Ah, uh, this is where I'm sort of thinking, do we just save our money now? We need to get that next license, which is 125, so if we try and save till we hit 125, it would be better than, I think, replenishing stock. Right, what's he going for? Got all those of bread. This guy reminds me of, um... Oh, what's his name? The dude from Toy Story. Sid. It's Sid, isn't it? It reminds me of Sid. All it needs is a black t-shirt and it's like an older version of Sid. Toy Story. 100%. Bloody hell, three eggs. Obviously, not happy or someone's going to go and egg their house, by the looks of it. Right, throw that in the bin. Right, we definitely need some oil. Or we just don't worry about it. Right, just gonna throw that down there just to get it out of the way. Uh, some cereal that can go up there. Once you set the price, you don't need to set it again. So I've set it for here, so it's automatic for there, which is really good as well. You don't have to set it for each individual um, shelf. Two fifty. We're close to getting that one twenty-five we need. But I think we need to get level 3 anyway, but we should be there by the time we um, have enough money. Right, $14, $1 change. Right, let's have a look. $125 it is. And then we need $125 for a fridge. I don't believe I can sell the shelf either. Uh, 50 cents. Thank you. Let's get that next level. Alright. Purchase a fridge or a shelf. Fridge A. When I was playing um, by myself and just having a playthrough, I actually accidentally brought an extra bloody shelf instead of an extra fridge. So kind of shot myself in the foot there. But Alright, one dollar. Yeah, I'm just worried now that if we buy a fridge... We're going to have very little stock on the shelf. But we're out of pasta, we're out of oil. That's what I worry about now. So we're out of pasta, we're out of oil. Do I need to just cancel this? Uh, go pasta. Can actually probably get... Ah, uh, some candy, and that, and those, yeah, that's probably better off doing that than getting the fridge first, I think. Get some extra items. Ah, uh, 34, 10, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, thank you. Got one dollar, how much do we need for that? 104, take off the peanut butter, we can purchase that, and then we'll put the peanut butter back in. Right, prairies. Throw that. 305 to a 350. Now the next one is other lollies. I'm not even sure what these things are. Uh, one, two, three, four, done. 
378 or 25 will do. He didn't like the cost of something. Right, pasta. It's now shut. Oh, it's still coming in. That's fine. Ah, it's too expensive for you. Okay, let's go four dollars. Make two dollars and everything. I'll be pretty happy. I think. Two dollars, three dollars, three fifty for flour. So we need bread and pasta. Right, finish the day. Three too expensive. It made three hundred and ten dollars. Awesome. Uh, less less peds oil is up. We need to make sure we get that ASAP. Um, do we have it? We don't even have any oil. Oh, actually, the unit price has gone up. I thought the sale price went up. I know the sale price does go up when the unit price goes up, but we had had a couple of extra boxes of bloody oil. That would have been really good. Right, good morning, sir. One dollar. What can we get for that? We can get the bread. And we'll go back and get the peanut butter. That's that's a bummer that's gone up. Way too expensive now, I think. Six fifty. How much do we need for that next order? Uh, 50 bucks. Actually, yeah, 38, 40, I should say, 40 bucks. Alright, we're going to need some more bloody eggs too. So, I mean, I feel like it's just, um, I mean, I know we've got to replenish our stock, but it seems like we're just doing it way too quick. Uh, maybe the boxes would be the same price, but have double the amount in them. Like I said, a 12 have 24 instead of, what's that? 12 have 24, I, I don't know. Uh, perfect. I feel like these are pretty good. If we look at those guys, uh, get 18 in a box, get 12 in a box. Yeah, not too bad. Uh, did we? Oh, shit, I didn't even bring the bread in. That's not good. I did order it and left it out the front. Uh, one dollar, we've got one lot of cereal left too. Bloody hell. Uh, I'm going to need like 50 bucks for cereal. Yoink, get rid of that. 6.49, let's go 7 bucks. Four dollars profit for peanut butter. Hell yes. Need to just sell pure peanut butter and that's it. 10, 15, 17, thank you. Going straight for the lollies. And some peanut butter. Two lots are the three lots. Was it looks like marshmallows? Marshmallows and peanut butter. Great mix. $29. Dollar change. Thank you. I feel like we need eggs. Cereal. Uh, let's go get rid of that, get the eggs first, and then grab the cereal back on. I'm going to throw them next to it purely because I'm not going to buy that oil while it's that high price. Alright, eggs and bread. One bitty. I'll take the cash first. Eighty nine fifty. That's a lot of money. We got 36. Uh, that's what I... I just don't know if we just keep saving. Maybe we just buy this one lot of... Um, milk or cereal. Because we want to get milk and water. Like the water's pretty good. 15, 20. With any luck, we'll make some decent money out of the water. Uh, 30 bucks, 50. 
too expensive for you, mate. You're wearing a bloody suit. $9. Uh, let's... The, this is the last thing we order before we go for our fridge. Furniture. Make sure we select the fridge and not another shelf. Display is full. Bloody hell, we're running low on pasta too. But every time I refill something... Done. So I have seen as well, guys, um, completely different game, but King of Retail 2 has been announced as well, so that's going to be awesome. That's a game that I loved, the original King of Retail. Um, I got abandoned a little bit by the developer, purely because it was on an old game engine and that sort of stuff, and they were kind of stuck as to what they could do with it, where they could go. So looking at King of Retail 2 is going to be pretty bloody awesome. Hopefully this game will be um, just as good once a developer you know, releases it to us properly and... Um, couldn't find pasta. Sorry, mate. Um, once he releases it to us properly, like the f full early access release, and then continues to build on it, it should be pretty good. Want how much cereal dish you want to? Grab some peanut butter. Oh, no. Two cereal, two marshmallows. 22 bucks, thank you. We need to turn that light on. Definitely want to get the fridge by the end of today. What are you up to there? This is day three, isn't it? So eventually we'll be able to hire staff to do this while we do other things, but I don't know what else we could actually do. Unless the more we expand, the more products we have, the busier we get, then we'll pretty much be restocking shelves all the time. Uh, One dollar. Zero dollars. Come on, we need like three dollar plus delivery. Which is how much? Only three dollars delivery, that's pretty good. For a fridge anyway. Alright, that should be enough. Ten fifty, thank you. Let's get the fridge. Products, I want to get milk and bottled water straight away. Boom, there we go. Need to open the door? No. Ah, bread's not gonna help me. Forty seven fifty. You bring a fifty dollar note for bloody bread. What do you need? We need 30, 33, 33 dollars. We're nearly shot for the day already. Come on, people. We need pasta, we need oil. There's a few other things we haven't got. Nothing coffee is one of them. Ah, uh, coffee. One of the new ones. Well, late customers, right on closing time. Don't buy all me bloody flour. Jesus. Probably the same dude that whinged about the prices earlier. Brings in a hundred dollar note just to be a pain. Right, finish the day. Uh, Two seventy-eight fifties. We didn't make as much yesterday, but. Total profit, we actually made a profit today. Um, prairie cake, milk. So prairie cake, if we click on that now, $3.11, so it's gone up. Uh, what else had gone up? So that should be back down. Ooh, no, that's... That seems to be a permanent increase of milk, bread, and the prairie cakes. But the coffee's gone down. 2.59 oh, we want it to be ah milk bread prairie cakes I think they're still pretty good yeah that's fine 
Just need to work out what we need now. It's gone up a little bit, so 30, 36 bucks. Actually, we're so close to actually having enough. Probably could have ordered it yesterday. Well, that was nine o'clock. Master and oil. Don't buy all the flour. Thank you. Ah, uh, 50 cent. Okay, all right, let's get this ordered. Bottles of water. Done. Hold on a sec, mate. Who doesn't get the, get the poops and disappear? There goes me flour. Thank you. Right, milk. Four oh eight, four dollars fifty. Water, three thirty two. Let's go three dollars eighty. Smashes out the milk straight away. Thank you, mate. Eighty six fifty. Unbelievable. Right, so we need Uh, flour, pasta, and oil. I think oil can wait. Definitely want to get coffee though. Especially while the price is low. One prairie cake's not going to help me, mate. So purchase a new section using your computer to expand your store. I don't think we need that quite yet, but what do we need for this? $63. Bottle of water. Unbelievable. Morning. Just. She got a tramp stamp. On her back, look at it go. Bet you she regrets that now. Right, one dollar change done. Let's get that ordered. Uh, I want to go coffee next. Buddy Winger, honestly. Flour. Peanut butter's a hit. Only got two left. Right. One dollar. Good. Fifty two, fifty six, we fifty six bucks for you. That's bloody that is so expensive. I don't know if they're a permanent price increase either. Um, feels like the oil's a permanent price increase. Of course, unless it discounts again at a later stage. I think every day it, it sort of changes as to what's um what's the highest price and that sort of thing. But I don't think the demo limits us on time. I think the demo just limits us on um, what's actually available in the shop or our shop. Here comes Sid. God, we're out of prairie cakes. Prairie cakes, just about. And milk. Jesus. Big spender, though. Four fifty. Let's get the coffee. Uh, let's go milk. Prairie cakes, add them to the list. Three dollars, that's not three dollars. And peanut butter, we're out. Jesus. Okay, peanut butter, add you to the list. Need eighty-six dollars. Uh, there. Hold on a sec. Uh, nine, let's go eleven dollars. 
Uh, 50 cents, thank you. There, there goes our peri cakes. What do we need for this? 85.22, we're not far off. Uh, nothing, do we get prairie cakes? Yeah, prairie cakes, peanut butter, and some more milk. Hoping that sells, that's that's a pretty good earner. Even at eleven dollars, we'd probably make it ten ten fifty. Make it nine hundred and Ooh, look at that. One person brought that. That would be outstanding. You're a tight ass. Three dollars. Three dollars. They're not that expensive. I mean, the customer service is that good. You're paying for the customer service, not so much the product. Yeah, maybe you walk down the street and realise it wasn't that expensive and he's come back anyway. Can we add a loaf of bread to that? We need like 30 cents. Okay, get rid of the bread. Bang. Add the bread. Peanut butter. There goes a the coffee. There goes the milk. Lucky we had extra. Yep. Be there in a sec, Sid. Think. Holy dooly, that's a big spender. Forty-five dollars. Ah, uh, ten, twenty, or thirty-two, fifty, sixty, seventy. Uh, let's order that bread. Dump that, grab the bread. One milk, 50 cent. Throw that away. I feel like we're doing pretty good now. Hey, you should, oh, I thought she was going to grab a loaf of bread there, so grab that one. Uh, 80. Done. Should be a lucky last customer for today, I'd say. And we're going to need more flour. Thank you for that. Just clean me out right at the end of end of the day. Alright, so get rid of that. We need some flour. But let's look at that. 7056. See if that changes tomorrow. 328 profit, or 320 income, 73 profit. Good. Nope, nothing changed for today. Let's grab the flour. Can't even afford the oil anyway, even if I wanted to. I don't know if this is where I try and stock up or not. Like an extra milk, I think we need an extra milk. when I was playing I sort of um, had eggs, milk, cereal, pasta, whatever it was I had two of each which sort of slowed me down a little bit too but right out guys well that's going to be the end of our first look at um, Supermarket Simulator hopefully you guys did enjoy the first look at it if you guys want to see more make sure you smash that like button leave a comment and I'll have an episode 2 of the demo and then also when the full game or the full release of Early Access comes out we'll play it a little bit more as well but um, if you guys are new to the channel and haven't subscribed yet, guys, please do so. Being Brito, thanks for watching. We'll see you again soon.